going. I'm Katsuma, and I gotta say, this is definitely one of the best places to be. The Moshi World! Yay! Hello, everyone. I'm Puppet, and if you're looking for my place just to go, look my birthday meat and my baby Moshlings. <sighs> I wish Mr. Sudo was here to see this. Mr. Sudo! Hi, I'm Furry, and I'm, and, and I'm proud to say this. This is definitely the beginning of a new relationship. Me and my friends are forever family. Ooh, I can't wait to see what I'd say. Dudes, <laughs> yeah, this is Cyber speaking. I've got nothing to say here, but this is just the beginning of something new here. We want me to, to cover something? I got you covered. Yeah. Oh, hello, the name is Lovely. And I gotta say, when you're, when you're here together, we can do anything. And boy, this is definitely just the beginning. Ah, oh, good old times, darling. Good old times. And I'm Diablo. If you're looking for an adventure like like me, you know where to go to. Me and my friends can have a, a, a true me of relationships. And that's what I'm doing here today. Yeah! And together we are the Bashy Monsters! Welcome to episode 49 of Look at Moshi. Yeah, episode 49, Logan and Moshi. As you know, we're getting ready to pack up to Walt Disney World tomorrow, so be prepared for it. So the next episode will be... Yes, yeah, the next episode will be for Orlando. So be on the lookout for that. Yeah, I can't wait for Orlando on Thursday. So, so be prepared. But right now, we gotta get ready for today's episode. It's gonna be so amazing. Remember, new episodes every Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday. So please subscribe so you don't miss out. And don't forget, tomorrow is the Moshi Wednesday Bunch of Mirror. We're going to Moshi Wednesday. We're going to Moshi Sleep Fairy Ashes. Moshi Bunch of or Moshi Moshi Bunch of Tomorrow to find out. But, but we won't be there because we're picking up for Lando tomorrow. So sorry about that, people. However, we still got plenty of time to do it. So, get getting ready. It's going to be a lot of fun. So, get ready. Now, let's get ready to get started. Are you ready? Here we go. For today's episode, episode 49, we're taking a look at the CW. And boy, this is going to be amazing. The CW! That's right! That's today's episode! Dallas, are you talking about the CW? Let me explain it. C... Ooh, sorry. Oh. There we go. W! Uh, let me try again. C... Ugh. No. Oh, come on! There we go. Much better. CW. <laughs> that's much better. So yeah, that's what we're talking about today. As you know, Miguel Sanchez talked about on episode 19 of his local history series. Now we're going to talk about today on this show. Evidence Hempsey, episode 48. Yes, this episode was about the WTDJ, a, a city of television station rising to Roanoke, Virginia. So, yeah, which is our makeup episode for Sunday. So go check it out right now. My tia says it's pointing right up there. To the top right corner screen, so go click on the video and see for yourself. Otherwise, let's get into the video. First things first, images are taken from Wikipedia. Credit goes everywhere. The images that you're about to see does not belong to us, nor to Miguel. He created this series, so keep that in mind. And one final thing we need to mention. Well, there we go. Today's video was requested by Raven Garza to Lego CEC and Rollins Fanatic 2006. Thank you for requesting Raven Garza to Lego CEC and Rollins Fanatic 2006. And he also put in the hashtag Lego History Moshi. So, yay! Thank you so much! Go to his channel right now. We have a link in the description below. Thank you for requesting Raymond Garza to Logo CEC and Roblox for 9006. Now, let's get started. Here's the show by Rhodes who don't know what, what the CW is. The CW Television Network, commonly referred to as simply the CW, is an American English language broadcast and television network that's operated by the CW Network LLC, a limited liability joint venture between the CBS Entertainment Group units of five com CBS, the owner of the defunct television network UPN, and the studios networks and, and the studios and networks division of AT&T's Water Media, the parent company of Water Person Entertainment, former majority owner of the WB. The network's name is an abbreviation of the, the, the network's is an abbreviation derived from the first letters of the names of the of its two parent companies. Vicon CPS and Water Media. Yeah. So, so there you go. C W. And that's right, the C in Vicon CPS and the W in Water Media. So there you go. That's what I love. Mm, that's what that's the way I like it. Slobber. Got it, furry butter. Alright, that's better. 
the CW Television Network made its debut on September 18, 2006, after its two predecessors, UPN and the WB, respectively ceased inter independent operations on September 15th and 17th of that year. The CW's first two nights of programming on September 18th and 19th, 2006, consists of reruns and launch-related specials. The CW marked its formal launch day on September 20th, 2006, with a two-hour premiere of the seventh cycle of America's Next Top Model. Originally, the network's programming lineup was intended to, to appeal mainly to women between the ages of 18 to, and 34. Of those ranking 2011, the network's increase, the network increased in programming that appeals to men. As of August 2017, the CW's audience is 50% male and 50% female. The network currently runs uh, runs programming seven days a week, airing nightly in prime time, along with a Saturday morning live action educational programming blog produced by Little Entertainment called One Magnificent Morning, which is a successor to the animation blog Vortex, which was then called Toonzai, which was then called the CW for Kids, which was then called Kids WB. So, yeah. Now you know, puppets! I love you, Summer. Moving on. It is also available in Canada on paid television providers through stations owned and operated by Ficon CBS and affiliates that are located within proximity to the Canada United States border, whose broadcasts of the CW shows are subject to never holds are subject to simultaneous substitution laws imposed by the Canadian Radio Television and Communication and Telecommunications Commission. If a Canadian network holds the broadcast rights, so that's good. It is also available through the two affiliates that are classified in the United States as superstations. New York City affiliate WPIX and Los Angeles affiliate KTLA. WA, by the way, WPIX is, is owned by Mission Broadcasting and KPIX and KTLA is owned, it's owned by Nextstar Media Group. So remember that. Diablo! Bell do! I'll finish this. Additionally, the CW is available to, in Mexico through affiliates located near the Mexico-U.S. border, such as KFMB, TT2, San Diego, Tijuana, KECY, DT3, El Central California, KVIA, DT2, and El Paso, and KC, and, KW, and KTWT, DT, with simulcasters with simulcasters KMBH, LD2, and, and KNVO, DT4, in McAllen, Brownsville, Texas, and, H, and XHRIO, TDT, in and my tomorrow's the Tommy bus on paid television providers in both Canada and Mexico. Some the CW affiliates, the, some the CW affiliates signals originating from the U.S. are receivable over the air and in border over the air in border areas, depending on the stations and signal coverage. Katsuma, do the stats. Will do, Diablo. Here I go. Moving on to the stats. Channel Impetus CW, broad, broadcast, launching September 18, 2006. Owners are the CBS Entertainment Group, which is 50% owned by Viacom CBS, and Warner Media, which, 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 which is 50% owned by AT&T, with a penny merger with Discovery, uh, with a penny merger with Discovery Incorporated, to form Warner Brothers Discovery. Warner Brothers Discovery. The stuff where dreams are made of. So remember that. Headquarters are probably California, U.S. There's slogan is there to defy. Website is www.cwtv.com. Cool. Check it out right now. The link will be in the description below. And now, let us begin the local history of the CW. Here we go, guys! 1994 to 2002. Before we start with the CW, we gotta start with the two predecessors of the, of the network. Starting with UPN, the United Paramount Network. So here we have here a, a three shape, three white shapes all connected to each other and on a black line. A circle, a triangle, and a square. On inside of that lens, UPN in bl black text. So that's all I gotta say. Here's the inverted version and the version with the wheel bike. 1994 to 1998, the has been removed. The circle, the circle is now yellow. The triangle is now green. It's now blue, and the and the square is now red. Uh, here's the variants. The print version of the variants. The bird, the silver version with the wheel bike. Uh, I know. Uh, but the three D colored version. Now that's something. And we have the version. And we have the print version with the wheel bike. So that's all I gotta say. 1998 to 2002. It's the same look up, but now all the shapes are now in the silver gradient. So that's all. Here's the version with the wall mark. With the full name and the version with the slogan, the new destination. 2002 2006. This is the final look of UPN. We have here a, a <laughs> white circle on a black outline inside the letters UPN in black text. And the logo is in another perspective. Looking to the top left. So that's all I gotta say. Here's the orange version and the. <laughs> Uh, and the red and silver 3D version. And finally, to have said, we have the unused logo for what's free. What we're supposed to be branded as Paranormal, but unfortunately, that didn't happen. We have here. Sorry. So we have here 12 
black stars. Out of them, there's a black triangle representing a mountain. Out of them, there was Paramount and the network in black text. Sorry, darlings. That's all I gotta say. Pirates. Thanks, lovely. My turn. Moving on. 1995 to 1998. Here we have the other half of the CW, the WB. So we have here a black shape inside that's worth the white text. On the right, but there was WB, a white text on a black outline. So that's all there. So that's all I gotta say. Here's a version with the Marcel Television Network, a variant, the, an ID, the version with Michigan Dream Fry, the, the, the Network's mascot at the time, and, a, and an advertising for Gap. Gap, how could this be? 1998, 2006, a silly logo, but now the logo is but now the logo is tilted, so that's all. Here's a version with the Marcel Television Network, the version with Michigan Dream Fry, the, the Oscar Bug, and a variant used on print advertisements as well. That's very rare. That's all. That's A, they changed the name to the WB.com. So we have a band logo. Now the whole look, now everything is black. The shape is now white. The shape is now white. The word is now in black text. The letters W and B are now in black text. I'm not a white outline. And now under it, now under it, there's a white, there's a black, there's a white shape. And under it, there is the dot com in black text. And now above the shape, there's a beta, beta in red text. And the whole logo is on a white, it's on a, hmm, let me see. Oh yeah, right. Red back, black background. So that's all. Times eight to times ten. We have the word B in black text. On the right, there's a black square. On it, there's letters W and B in white text. That's good old times. Here's the version of the slogan. It's TV online. Except the logo is silver, so that's all. And finally, just 10, just 13. We have the words B and W B in, in gray, green text. Good old times. Katsuma will do. I'll have the five more here. Just six. A lot less. They're about to relaunch. A lot less. UPF and WB are about to, re re are about to merge into the CW. We have this pre launch logo. So here we have the pre launch logo. We have here a blue rectangle. Inside the letter words not in CW in white in white text. The letters C and W are are connected to the are connected to the top, are connected to the bottom and right quarters of the right of the, of the, of the rectangle. And out of the rectangle, letter words television and network in blue text. Man, that was a lot of fun, but now you know. And finally, Tasha 6 to the present, long last, both UPF and WB are done. So now they're I use they're gone forever as they emerge become the CW. Yeah! <laughs> we have here the last C and W in green text connected to each other. In the middle, let's see, there's worth the in green text. Woo! And that's the logo of Crazy today. That's the logo. This logo has, despite it, despite it began broadcasting in 2006, this logo, this logo has never changed. That's right, this logo has never changed after 15 years. Now, after 15 years on the air, this logo has never changed. It will stay that way. So congratulations to you. Well done, CW. You deserved it. <laughs> That's a lot of fun. Here's a print version of variants. The version without the word that used on some CW affiliates. We have the white, we have the on-screen bug. The version with the slogan TV Now, used from 2012 to 2015. We have the we have another version with the slogan TV Now, another TV Now version. We have the version with the current logo, Dare to Defy, used from 2015 to 2016. Man, I love this logo. We have, um, we have the version with the same size logo, used since 2016. And we have the Prime Month version. That's all colorful. So well done, CW. You deserved it. And that's it for today. Thanks for watching today's episode of Logo Hizemoshi. Yay! Can't believe, guys. We finally made it to the end. Uh, the next episode of Logo History will be Best Buy. On Logo History 2, we'll be taking a look at WTVW, KDEF, WSAB TV, and Racing King Chicken Fingers. And, um, and, but tonight on Serial Supremacy, we've got Plus Magica versus We Very Loose. We'll be look up it as well. Um, and on Mochi Monster Bay, we'll be taking a look at the Baby Machines. That's coming soon, so stay tuned for that. Hope you all had a lot of fun, and can't wait to see you all on Thursday for the next episode. That's right. Can't wait to see you all Thursday. For now, we've had the Moshi Team Result. See you Thursday from Orlando with another episode of Logo Is Moshi. And don't forget to request a logo for the next episode in the comments below. You will never know what logo you might appear next because when YouTube turns the comments, we turn back on so that way we know who requests which logo. That's right, darlings. I mean, that's right, rockers, dudes. You better be prepared. And please request a logo for the next episode in the comments below because we may like hard bit. What are your comments for the next episode? Do it now. Now. Man, it's a lot of fun. Go do it now. And last but not least, please remember to leave a like, share this video with your friends, leave a comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, our channel means that, and also turn on notifications to not miss a new video. Subscribe to me because it's attention on the channel on YouTube to not miss a new video from him or from us, as this channel is on the road to 1,400 subscribers. Thank you for watching episode 49 of Logo Hissimo, she fucking on the CW. We'll be back the Thursday for what I know with another exciting episode. If not, we'll we'll, we'll, we'll see this the next time around. But now, thanks for watching. I'm Katsuma. I'm Puppet. I'm Furry. I'm Zomber, I'm lovely, and I'm 
Diablo. Until Thursday for Fernando. Now she's out. Cheers to the bye. Till Thursday. Laters.